No more worries about hardware or GPU issues for AI beginners. Say goodbye to complex installations and settings, and no need to spend a fortune on high-end computers. Start your free SD learning journey effortlessly today. Introducing Mimic PC is a free online AI generator that offers access to a wide range of AI applications like Stable Diffusion 3, Face Fusion, Focus, Comfy UI, and more. Perfect for pros and beginners, it lets you create and learn AI right from your browser. Just three easy steps to run popular AI apps, focusing on creativity without technical hassles. Plus, it offers the cheapest storage and computational resources. Let's take a look at some of the fantastic AI applications you can use on Mimic PC. Using Mimic PC is incredibly simple and user-friendly. First, navigate to the Mimic PC website and simply sign up for an account. I will provide the link to Mimic PC in the description below. All right, once logged in, you'll find a dashboard with a variety of AI applications ready to use. Select the AI app you wanna run. You have many options. So let's start by using Focus. I'll just click on Get Started. Then you don't need to do much here. Just choose your hardware. You have two hardware options, medium and large. The large one will be faster than the medium one. I'll try the large one now because it provides me with 24 GB of VRAM. Okay, after this, turn on Automatic Extend and then simply click on Create and Start. All right, it will take about 30 seconds to open depending on the hardware you selected. Okay, now we have the Focus dashboard open. Everything might look blank to you right now. If you look here, you have two options. If I tick Input Image, you can upload an image and generate a new variation of that image. All right, but for now, we will prioritize prompt to image. So I'll leave this unticked and enable the advanced option. All right, now many features and options are enabled here, which you can use during image generation. Let's generate an image now. For that, you need to have a good prompt. I have this prompt that I'm going to try. I'll just copy it and paste it here. Okay, after that, you need to scroll down and you can also add a negative prompt here. This will help generate your image more better. I have a negative prompt, so I'll just copy it and paste it here. Perfect. And I'll share all these prompts on my Telegram channel so you can copy and use them from there. Okay, after this, you can try any preset you like in the settings. For performance, keep it on speed for now. Then you can select the aspect ratio below. Now, if I go to styles, you will find many styles here that you can apply to generate images in different styles. I've already applied three styles, so I'll also apply focus photograph. Okay, after that, choose the model. Then in advance, you can increase the guidance scale and image sharpness. After doing this, just click on generate. The image generation process is underway. It will take a maximum of 30 seconds. If you chose fast hardware at the beginning, it will generate even faster. All right, now see the image has been generated and the result is really shocking. Just look at the color combination, texture and style in the image. It looks really realistic. Let's try a different style now. I'll select focus photograph. This time I select this one too and simply generate it. Again, your new image will be ready you will see that the image style is totally different from the previous one. All right, now you can download this image. All right, let's generate another image. I have another prompt ready. I'll copy and paste it here, and I'll also add the negative prompt. This time, I wanna generate two images, so I'll set it to two. Then we'll choose realistic preset. And for the style, I'll select these two styles. Then I'll simply click on generate. The image generation process is starting, and look, Two images have been generated. Both images have the same face, but different styles. This time, the images have been generated in a different style. If I try generating a new image by changing the style again, you'll see that the same image is generated, but this time in yet another different style. So this is how you can use Focus on Mimic PC. Once the image generation is complete, you can stop it from here. Okay, now let's try a new app, which is Face Fusion. For this, you need to go back to the dashboard. Then simply go to Face Fusion and click on Quick Start. Then follow the same steps as before and hit Create and Start. Again, this will take some time depending on the hardware you selected. Okay, so this is the Face Fusion dashboard. Don't worry, it looks complicated, but it's not. Okay, here you have many options, but for now, we only need to focus on Face Swap. All right, here you will upload your source image and here you will upload your target image. So let's upload the source image first. Then I'll upload the target image here. Both images have been uploaded. You can see that rendering has started, but this is just a preview. The final output will be shown below. Now I'll just click on start. You'll see that the face swap processing has started here and your image will be swapped within a second. And here is the result. The image has been swapped quite well. The color, contrast, and depth are all well managed. So 
the overall result is quite amazing. Now, you can download this image. Okay, if I select the frame colorizer, you'll see that it will regenerate the image, and in the preview, you'll notice some changes in the images, making them slightly different from the previous ones. This way, you can generate different variants of the same image. Let's try another image. This time, I'll swap the faces of these two images with each other. I'll quickly upload both the source image and the target image. Okay, now I'll simply click Start. Within a second, the image will be generated. You'll see that the face swap has been done very well again and the result is pretty awesome. Okay, so this is how you can also do face swaps in Mimic PC. Additionally, you can try all these apps without paying anything. You can easily access Comfy UI and all other apps in the same way. There's no need to visit each app's website or download multiple apps. Mimic PC provides you access to all these apps in one place. All right, let's talk about the price. While you can try it for free without a credit card, if you want to use it long term, you might need to purchase it. You simply need to go to add funds and the price is shown there. You can make payments through PayPal or card. All right, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tech insights and tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.